because I'm super, super hyped for this. Hello, everybody. Yes, I'm looking pale and welcome to Crusader Kings 3 Princes of Darkness mod. You may have seen me stream this about a month or two ago, and uh, I was just gushing all over its face uh, because it's this is a mod created uh, homemade by uh, a group of people on the Princes of Darkness Patreon page. There will be a link in the YouTube description. Or you can just type command and mod to go directly to the Steam page. And take a look, because I think this is the greatest mod to a single video game forever. It's right up there with that Game of Thrones mod for CK2. That's how hard, that's how hard I am for it. Um, this is a complete transformation to a World of Darkness, which is a intellectual property owned by Paradox, but give, Paradox have given their blessing to this group of people to create mods for it, which is absolutely amazing of them, to be honest. Um, this is a vampire world on top of the real world. We don't really know what's going on. We don't really know what's going on in the world. I'm going to show you now. So this is basically 2.0, I think, or maybe, I don't know, it's the DLC. They've added, well, you would have seen me play Dark Ages Vampire as one of these vampires who, some of them are historically people, I think this is, yeah, Helen of Troy was the thinker one I played uh, when I streamed it. But then these people are vampires all vying for power at some point, an event happens. I don't know exactly what happens, or if it's even reflected in the game. But here I am, all the same. Uh, what's happened is now they've released Dark Ages, the Inquisitor version. So you're playing here as the vampires, but here you're playing Vampire Hunters. That is cool as hell. Yeah, it is that Helena of Troy. That's the thing. These people are immortal. Um, you gotta remember that. So this is basically we're playing the Inquisition versus these vampires. And all the vampires you see here are reflected in this game uh, scenario here. And it's up to us to kill them all. Um, yeah, in 1230 AD. Okay, I'll read the blurb. Led by a stalwart group of monster hunters, the Holy Church has finally come to realize the threat that are the vampires, forming a new secretive organization named the Shadow Inquisition, which is metal as hell. Uh, these heroes are the first humans to try reconquering the night and push back its horrors. The task for them is immense. And the cursed bloodsuckers had centuries to entrench themselves and prepare for the counterattack. The so-called Inquisitors are ready to die as martyrs. If their sacrifices pave the way for a better future for humanity, they fight for a cause. And that is more than any vampire could claim. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Um, they did expect it because they were preparing. So technically, these vampires were preparing for the Shadow Inquisition. They expected it. <laughs> All right, so... Also, yes, also, I did a thing on it. This is a, I, did, I wasn't actually sure this was going to come with the mod itself. I thought it would maybe just be a private for a dev build. But the patron war exists, which is in 1375. So we were at a certain level of, of backing, which I was at. You could add yourself to the game, or sorry, add a character in the universe theme to the game. Which I did. <laughs> I added this guy. I made Hannibal Barker. Hannibal was a vampire and he's been asleep for, you know, a thousand five hundred years. Uh, whatever it is. And uh, there's no text here, but everyone else, or most people... Oh, no, maybe oh, one of them has wrote, written an entire novel there to sort of... Yeah, there's... Also, these are other patrons making their characters. And it's great. I made Hannibal and I checked. He is the best general ever of the selection of people here. Um, so I'm not going to play that today because I think that's mainly mainly for me that would be interested in it. Uh, so yeah, incredible, incredible mod. Delighted to be a backer on it. And now I'm going to stream it for a bit. I'm going to do the Inquisition stuff. Um, Iron Man? Iron Man enabled? I don't think that's necessary needed. Actually, yeah, I'm going to keep it off. Um, yeah, Maria Immaculada. Let's play somewhere nice and familiar. Let's go to the UK. And, um, yeah. Morketh, uh, hello, mate. How are you? Hope you like the mod. I'm already rock hard for it. I'm, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> I am rock hard. A simple breeze could tip me over the edge. Okay, so Maria Immaculada is 41. Queen of the Sisters of St. John is our country. 
Uh, the current leader of the Sisters of St. John isn't the founder of the order, but her will is as strong as one of Mother Teresa, her blessed predecessor. To call her personality formidable is to suggest that the Pope is the only little bit holy. Wow. So I am totally zealot, rock-hard lady uh, who is going to take over all of the vampireness of the Britons, which is Mithras, who's been asleep for a long time. Um, I think I can't. Th I don't think I can do it anymore. Just this and say I, I just love the premise of this. I love the idea that I don't know anything about this universe at all. It's just come out of nowhere for me. Um, and yeah, a couple of months ago I tested it and was super amazed. Became a patron backer, and uh, now here we are. There's me, the recordist. Basically, I'm famous now. There we go. I'm a game developer. Sorry, a game producer. Yeah. All right. Uh, how are we going? Oh, you did the. Oh, we got a dev in chat. More curf is in the chat. Hello, mate. Wreck is the hattiest hat to ever hat. I get it. All right. Okay. Welcome to the Inquisitors of Darkness. Yeah. So first thing, thank you for playing the mod. You're welcome. Princes of Darkness is an overhaul of the base game. Yes. Aimed at bringing the world of darkness into life. Crusader Kings three, as such, is going to gameplay concepts. That, yeah. So total and utter rewrite of a lot of things, including now there are new trees for vampires and inquisitors alike, I assume. Uh, Princes of Darkness mod status. Oh, have I been tweeted out? Oh, you legend. Thank you very much. Wait, wait a second. Princes of Darkness mod himself. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'm Hasta of all of the extraordinaire on the Discord. Excellent. Promoting your stream on Twitter. Well, thank you very much, mate. That's really, really good. I better not say F or bugger. I better not swear. So, I think... I'll skip over this, then no one really wants to look at that. But you should really read it if you're new. Right, okay, so here's a, here's a situation. This is the world we recognize. Oh, hello, Spark. Yes, hello. This is the world you recognize. This is the sub-kingdoms there. You may even be familiar with some of the counties, such as York, Mercia. But the wool has been pulled over your eyes for millennia, as this is the real world. Yes, the baronies of Avalon, the courts of love, the courts of the Golden Cross, the Shadow Reconquista. Oh my god. Via Bacati? I don't know what the hell that is. Um, yeah, I've basically- oh yeah, by the way, I've turned off uh, whatever music would be in the game. This is copyright free stuff I've got for my subscription. And yeah, um, Bloodhood. These are all vampires. They're all vampires. And now, there's the Sisters of St. John. That is us. I am pulling back the true masquerade. Yeah, I should be playing Vampire Masquerade, but apparently Don has been on at me for a long, long time about it. So look, diplomacy, martial stewardship, intrigue, and learning, you're aware of it, but now there is one called the True Faith. I don't know if I have to click and do this to actually unlock it. Yeah, I think I have to, right? I basically have to click True Faith. So this is a different faith tree. Um, which will give all sorts of... I am unbondable. It means I cannot be bonded by vampires, which is one of their spells. Um, yeah, I'll, I know a little bit, but I don't know anything. If you have any specific questions, I'm sure Morkoth and uh, if Sark hang around, they'll definitely help anyone who cares about that kind of thing. It's an incredible world. I don't have only just dipped my little finger into it. Fantastic. Uh, right, okay, well, I'm going to be playing as her. Yeah, um... I'm gonna go on a specialty. Actually, let's double check that. Yeah, so I do I haven't unlocked this, or do I have to start the game for it to pop? I can't remember how that works exactly. But right, sister, this is me. I am a zealous, diligent, and patient lady who is 41 years old. But I am a member of well, wait, something gives me Yeah, there you go. Betific? Betific? A walking embodiment of the chosen god. His chosen god. There is a couple of times that gender's not um, taken into account on these texts. Um, but yeah. Of their chosen god. This character is a miracle worker. A true paragon of faith in a world of darkness. It gives them access to abilities sun might call unnatural. Nice. Basically, my health like is godlike. I am expected to live like, like close to 100. Pretty much close to 100 years of age. Once I unpause the character's true faith, I'll style a trio full. Okay, that's good. So, that's good. Yeah, that's what I thought would happen. So, I've got all sorts of... There's new traits popped into the game. I am a vampire hunter. I will live a long time. I'm very strong. Uh, I'm really good at being an administrator. 
Yeah, th basically, I am the ultimate nun. All right, so first things first, Crusader Kings thing. Let's get limited crown authority. I have Norwich, which has been buffed to hell, which I really like. Uh, Norwich now has, you know, full on six things. We also have a uh, Hospital of St. Cecilia. Any Inquisitor wounded in the British Isles knows and thanks the knowledgeable sisters present here for their care. You're welcome. There we go. The ultimate nun. Yeah. All right. Um, so entirely new build tree for both the vampires, I believe, and the Inquisition. I think some buildings definitely, yeah, some bit, yeah, you'll have to transfer them over from cultures. They're different. Um, yeah. So farm plus levies and gold plus prestige plus piety plus gold garrison and yeah, a whole new tree. Vampires are good at intrigue. You may have noticed that. Uh, since you can't marry, how do you get heirs? I'll get onto that in a minute, can't it? Because I think I figured out what happens. Um, so, I probably shouldn't build just yet. I will get a lot of money very soon. I have one holding, uh, but I do have people under me. I have an entire duchy there, Seast Anglia. And these guys, Ragnard von Aschenbach, his brother's keeper... Oh my god, that's the best. This has got the best names here. And who's this? Uh, Inquisitor Giordano Nicola de Atrenza, God's Mercy of Suffolk. <laughs> These guys are my vassals. But, you know, being a ruler and a steward, I can have seven duchies. So guess what? I'm going to just go straight in there. Tyranny up. The oh god, 58%. That's a bit closer than I thought. What about the other guy? Maybe if he likes me, he'll do that. I'm basically going to revoke titles if it's safe. 38? Oh god, it's not safe. What about Bedford? Ooh, 50. Right, okay. So, before I steal their titles, I'm gonna have to endear myself to them a little bit more, because 58% is a little bit higher than I would like. To, a little bit lower than the, the percentage I'd take a risk on. Uh, but, that's the next thing. But Norwich also has a King's Lynn is also there. So we can build that as well. Uh, right. Um, sorry, Mrs. just came in. All right, okay, champions. This is the main problem. The battle in this game is less about levies, more about your prowess. I believe prowess is a maximum of 100, I think we were talking about in Discord. Um, these guys are 49, so I'm going to force... I'm going to make sure all these people are in. I would like a blanket mod, which says... Um, don't get anybody who's got terrible... Martial ability to be there like six. I think there is a mod for that. I think I did test it and I think basically if I click the button anything under six wasn't able to be a knight um, But here we are all the same um, Yeah, so knights and prowess have the full Priority when it comes to armies You still need to have CBs. You can still declare holy wars, of course um, Which is what we'll be doing because you know woo piety and uh, yeah, also look at that. There's doves with <laughs> there's doves with cross in their, in their talons. I said, do doves have talons? Mrs. Wreck, uh, do doves have talons? Oh, I just don't know if they're. I thought talons as, was a spirit. I don't know if they're classified as talons. Or claws. claws. Yeah, where? Okay, question of the day: <laughs> talons or claws? Uh, what? What's the crossover point? I'm sure that's <laughs> There you go. No, I'm not asking Google. I'm asking Twitch chat. It's much more reliable. All right. You can negotiate alliances, apparently. Yeah. Uh, yeah, these are other sisters. They, one is all the way down here, who is technically my heir. Not sure how the heirs are chosen. However, there is always an heir, and it has to be female. Uh, but this is one. We're going to have an alliance, because why not? Um, there's also another one up here somewhere. Uh, yeah, there we go. It is in Bouillon. There we go. So, allies there. Uh, okay, lose land. A powerful vassal demands council position. No, you're a bleeder, and you have terrible stats, and people in front of you have better stats. So, just deal with it. Uh, third in line to inherit Bouillon. Oh, okay. Maybe a nice cheeky murder. No, I am pious. <laughs> I'm not going to cheekily murder those people. Hey, I made those buildings. Congratulations. Another mod is another mod. Another dev is here. Matt the Spoiled Brat. <laughs> Welcome, mate. Talons are claws for some predatory animals. Okay. Well, yeah, but... Uh, yeah, I don't... Let's, let's, let's leave that for now. 
We're gonna we're gonna put that over there. We're gonna leave that. Okay. I believe I have done everything I possibly could. Oh yeah, conversion needs to happen in Bedford because those guys are via Mithras, which is a religion in the game, which is basically a, a vampire religion, which is the vi religion of the boss, the big boss, Lord Mithras, the Lord of Light. He's over here. He has uh, rivals all over the place, including the guy that owns, uh, is it Yorkshire? Yeah, North Riding, whatever. He owns that. Now, there is a thing we can do. I'm going to try and make them weaker in general. I could kind of manipulate things to try and get him to attack his dad. I think that's going to happen in general. But you notice there, there are a couple of new things. Investigate. So investigate the lore about John D. York. So some characters have a lore button. And they are real in the, in the world. They are a real character. If I investigate, I'll learn more about them. And I think I am more likely to commit... Um, acts of intrigue against them. Ultimately, you want to kill them. And finding Lair, uh, you will try to obtain the learn the exact location of this fiend. When the hunt is on, obviously, it has serious risk involved. Basically, hunt down the vampire and kill the vampire. Or do other things with them once we've caught them. Uh, you already know the mod correctly, isn't it? Question, you already know the mod correctly, isn't it? Wait, what? I don't, I don't get that one. Uh, right, Mer so I'm going to investigate him. Let's investigate. It's going to take a year, 68% chance. Good, we'll find more information about him. Yeah, I'm playing the new Princes of Darkness. It's a big thing in our house. We talk about it a lot. <laughs> All right. Um, where are we? Where are we going? New follower. Oh, spoiled brat. Thank you for the follow. And I've just noticed that is way out of screen. That should not be up there like that. Thank you very much for the follow, guys. Um, right. Okay. I got several developers in the chat, yes. So what? Can you say something to the mods? You want to say something to the mods? I don't think they're worthy of your time. Okay, go ahead. What is it? Yeah, she she thinks vampires all come from Transylvania. Not in this world. I'm sure there is, right? She didn't. You didn't cover yourself in glory then, in your moment in the spotlight. You said all my words wrong, so fuck you! <laughs> Alright. Come over to the mic and say what you want to say no. when you can. No, you won't do it. Okay, great. Alright, we're playing. Play. A, a thing has happened. We have started the game. You guys need to train your knights. Sun versus cross. Okay, dilemma. Uh, England has always been a perplexing land to the Holy Church, clinging for a long time to ancient practices with rumors of witchcraft or worse springing from time to time. The island has never been truly tamed. Mother Maria, leader of the Sisters of St. John, is but the last of a long list of inquisitors trying to understand the roots of the corruption gnawing at the island. The visions of her sisters are talking about an entity known as Mithras. That's this dude who proclaims himself as a god as soon as the sun sets. So they worship the sun, but they come out when the sun's down because vampire. Something like that. Also, is this stuff... While well, I've got somebody here, is this stuff directly pulled from the law, or has one of you put this together? Because this is very well written. Um, and that happens to all of them, obviously. With this clear goal in sight, their relentless zeal as their weapon, the sisters are preparing to lead the Inquisition in the fight. They are only starting to understand the proportion. There is only one god. Excellent. All right, alliances are formed. You're training knights, which are super important. Culture, there is a culture issue. Oh, there is a culture issue. What's going on? Oh, we're from Catalonia. Oh, but I can change it. I can change? No, I can't. Yes, I can convert to English, which is at pretty much the same stat. You might as well just convert, really. Although they do get Caballeros, which I do like. I do like Caballeros. Thank you very much. All right. Um, the writing is our own, but the facts are from the law. Brilliant. Well done. Reconquista, what's that? Oh, less CB costs and monthly piety. Plus 10% piety? Percent? I am not the head of my culture. I don't think I'll be the head of this culture either if I switch because, I mean, it's going to be one of these two, right? Yeah, it'll probably be big, big, big dude. Mithras. Big dude with, with hat. Okay. Alright, well, 
Let's start. Oh yeah, I need to go speak to the Pope because um, pilgrimages still exist and we get extra couple of options. For example, oh not pilgrimage. Oh, I should do a pilgrimage, yeah? Yeah, I do a pilgrimage. I'll go into debt. But then I can ask the Holy Father for funds, which does cost piety. And I'm going to make sure I'm aware of that at all times. Yeah, funding request. Right, based on my stats, I can try and uh, squeeze a little bit more out of the Pope. Uh, the Holy Father or whoever he is. 8% uh, for a positive, 11%, 25%, or 64%. Move numbers around the ledges. So because I'm a steward, I can do math trickery and get more money from the Pope. 64% chance. That means there's a, you know, 46% chance this will go... Wait, no. 36% chance this will go wrong. Request additional funds. Alright, pilgrimage is off. Home on Holy Father. You managed to justify the budget. Really? I got 300 and some stewardship. Also, Invite Prospect is here. This is basically youth development program. And I get uh, this lady, Ralinda Despwig who I can choose to bring over to my court for a small fee. Yeah, and I can do things to increase their stats. Or the creative accounting, yes, that's the word. That's the Those are the two words. You're familiar with creative accounting? <laughs> Is that why? <laughs> no, forget it. All right, men at arms, less important than champions, but I am hamstrung is that I only have mortals for champions. Vampires? have access to all sorts of stuff, uh, including other vampires, which are usually extremely high in the prowess. But there's also weird things like ghouls. Um, I don't think this person has any just yet. Um, but yeah, these are all humans. You can see the humans, but then they got vampires like this. This person's got 25 piety, and they're not very strong militarily. Um, let's have a look for more vampires. Vassals, there we go. I reckon all the vassals, yeah. Vassals, 24, got all these stats. He is, I don't know what that is, he's a vampire, so he's got the same godlike bonuses that I had. You also have the Ventru, and the Auspices, uh, Celery, <laughs> Prowess plus 5, Dominate, Prowess, yeah, all sorts of things. This is the key thing though, Prowess needs to be high. The problem is, I only have mortals and they have vampires. For the most part, they're just mortals. Some of them have, like, real 51. Look at this dude. Absolute monster. All right, so levies are less important. Men at arms, secondary, and champions first. It's, like, a different priority list than it is in the, in the base game. Oh, boy. All right, uh, play more. Let's play more while we... Well, I think the idea right now is to get Mercia. Mercia is run by a vampire. Protector Robin Leland, the Outlaw of Mercia. Not Robin Hood. All right. Uh, who's this guy? Oh, we've trained a new guy. 22 prowess. Oh, God. He's slow. All right. Well, he doesn't need to be particularly smart. Pilgrimage, the mystic. Amma is one of the stranger people I've met on this journey. Okay, good. I'm quite curious. Oh, she's led me into a tent. Uh, comfortable. I'm going to get fleeced for money, but I get a little boost. Five gold for... Small boost and stress game reduction for five years. That's good. Okay. Uh, I can declare wars. These all be holy wards, I guess. Yeah, I could go straight for Mithras right now. That would be a bad idea, I think. Unless I'm not aware of something. But his kingdom used to be all of this. But he's been asleep for a while. And this dude has popped up. Or has been running it. So, first things first is get Mercia. Split, is, split the island in half, pretty much. Uh, right. I have some money. I'm going to use it to build something which will get me money. For example, control the townsfolk. Here people congregate and money changes hands. Our cause requires both. Stewardship bonus. Cool. Uh, that red hat looks like the one Louis XIV was forced to use. The one and only. Oh, right. Well, that's a Feigian hat. Okay, yeah. Don knows a little bit about this. Um, he knows a lot more than I do because um, he played the Masquerade games, I think. And uh, also is a board gamer. I am less of a board gamer. But I like to learn. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Go. Okay, back from my pilgrimage now. I am pieted up. That means I can do various things. Actually, what's the quests here? Right, okay. Support from the Knights of Accra. I should probably be working towards these uh, missions. 
Realm size is 75 or more. Oh, God. Kingdom of Cyprus must be held. Thessalonica and... Montano and Alfonso of Venice, the two main vampire opponents of the knights, must be dead or in torpor. So forcing them to sleep? I think that's what torpor is. Cool. Support from the Sisters of St. John. Uh, Kingdom of England must be held by someone of the Shadow Inquisition face. So basically I become a King of England and Mithras and Marcus, the two vampire opponents. Is this Marcus? No, who's Marcus? Marcus Verus? I don't know who that is. Oh, well. Um... Marcus. Oh no, I can't search there, can I? It's not the same. Okay, one of these. There's Montano. Actually, you'll have a brother, right? Uh, sibling. Who's this? Duchess. That's a girl. Oh, it is. Yeah, he's in there. Can you get flamethrowers or something? I did see... Recover Greek fire. Yes, recover Greek fire. Have a scholar, illustrious, and at least one of these. Searching the city for the formula requires 12 intrigue and controlling Constantinople. God, there's so many cool shit in here. Isn't it? It's so good. Ooh. Love it. All right. Okay. Let's build up our power base. And what can we do here? Succession is Ultimo Genta. Can I change that? No, not right now. But youngest child inherits. I don't understand how the children are made. Marcus is the chilled. Oh, childe. How would you pronounce that? Oh, is that you? There he is. Oh, this angry looking boy with a bowl cut. A resentful homosexual zealot. Right, interesting. Um, ooh. That's his granddad. This dude over here in Kabul? Oh my god, I bet you can get claims for it then. If he's your granddad, you've got to be able to get something. You ornate, uh, ornate characters in your order as your heir. Right, okay, so that was the... Um, it has to be female. It's, there's intercession, which is giving them a true faith buff. But how is that... Oh, okay, here's Law of John, by the way. Uh, ambitious baron born just after the Norman conquest of England. John has proved well suited for the Cainites politics. So this is where the source of the vampires are. It's Cain, the first murderer, something like that. Betraying his sire... At an opportune time, he was quick to pledge, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Yeah, this guy is is an enemy of this guy. Um, so we kind of use them to play off each other. Brilliant. Okay, let's keep going. And hopefully we'll develop the economy quite quickly. <clears throat> Sisters have to be female. That makes sense. Doing it for themselves. Um, so I can basically declare holy war on any vampire kingdom because religion. Yay. Mercia has 2,500, no alliances, and I have 481. That's a significant reduction. I should probably wait until he's either declared war on or loses something. They have to be mortal. The landed characters are already okay. So they have to... All right. Thank you, Matt. Oh, I'm, I'm learning so much already. All right, vassals, all good. Men at arms. Uh, I'm not even sure if I should bother with that just yet. I'll just keep building in Norwich. <laughs> it's weird having Norwich as a capital. Who cares? I'm sure they don't. Yeah. <laughs> they did write it. Uh, but basically, for the purposes of the stream, people don't need me to read everything, right? Unless they want me to. Wait, should I read everything? Second question of the day. Do you want me to read all of the blurb? Okay, Rectrix sounds cool as hell as well. Maria Immaculada, God's scribe. What's this? Unbondable, right? Yeah, okay. Hunter. All the member. Okay, I've got money and piety. Actually, one of the buildings just requires piety, right? One of that's that's a both. Prestige, prestige. I'm sure I saw one that was just piety. Do I already have it? I don't know. Hey, what's this, by the way? Remote office. Oh my god. Stewardship per level of devotion plus one. What? That's amazing! If you don't, I'll have to. Alright, Mr. Boardface, how's it going? There is cool Jin Wang Kuei, too, but they are no vampires per se. That rhymes. Anyway, good game. Take care, Morkoth. <laughs> that rhymes. You were pretty good there. Right, okay. Um, More money. 
More money, more money, more money. Taxes. Control the farmlands. That's always a good thing. So also, uh, I can... Actually, I can revoke your title for nothing, right? Because you're a baron. Yeah. Okay, so I can actually hold uh, temples and cities. I believe. Wait, not cities? Yeah, I can. Um, oh, my spy master was... I just evicted them. Okay, well, he's in there now. So I can definitely up my income by just taking these places. Oh, I can't take it from him because he's the top lord. All right, what about you now? 62% is still too high for me to take a risk. All right, let's go. And let's build in Walshingham. Temple, money, please. I'm going to make sure all the temples are money-based. And uh, the the capitals of the duchy will be probably military issue. In fact, I'm going to stop that. Yeah, I'm going to get all the military stuff that I can in the big in the big settlements. Oh, the music stopped, I just realized. Hmm. Okay. All right. Interesting Monarch Monday today, isn't it? Just another Monarch Monday. I'm going to do an intro for that, by the way. <laughs> I'm going to do a song. All right. Uh, give me... Yeah, okay. Contact fellow orders. So, oh, right. Control the garrison. Yeah, makes sense. Get Mrs. Rec to sing it. Mrs. Rec can't sing. Can you? Uh, more cops as well. Thank you for the follow. Sorry, I missed it. Uh, God protect us. What's going on here? Militant Einhaya. With the feral faithful. Yes, yeah, some of these vampires can turn into feral beasts, by the way. Gangrel. Uh, protein, that's the one. So these are disciplines that the vampires can choose. And they can turn into full-on monsters. Should they wish to. So you don't want to fight, though. She's got 45 prowess. Christ. God protect us. Yes, yeah, so that's basically a crusade launching for that particular offset religion. Yeah, but neither can you, so what's the difference? Valid point. Well presented. I like it. <laughs> All right, I have money now. Uh, shall we go ahead and build... Can we build this? We can. English culture has Mott's invention. Yeah, I want to build another castle. It's positioned quite nicely, actually. So, yeah. Metropolis. That's new. A populous town in which a large number of burrs, merchants, and hardworking folk... A populous... Yeah. So, that's a new building. Metropolis. 12,000 gold. But there it is. We're going to turn... <laughs> we're going to we're gonna turn King's Lynn into a metropolis. All right. Yeah. All right. Temples, money. Money temple. Just easier to understand. Money. Control the townsfolk. What's this? Ask Holy Father for funds. Is it time again? Requested a stewardship challenge. 64% chance. Uh-oh! The Pope wasn't fooled by your creative accounting, so I get no money and a hundred cost of piety. But I can always ask him, I believe. Is it the actual Pope? No, he's got 96. Why does he love me so much? Oh, plus 25 because I'm a hunter as well. Yeah, okay. That's good. Invite prospect, yes. Special prospect can come in. She's got 15. True faith. Right, so I could do ordination. Acknowledge Orem Bax as your... Okay, let's do this. I'm going to ordain her as my heir. Oh, it's a scheme. And it takes 10 months. Is it... It doesn't take a spot? It does. It takes up a diplomacy spot. Okay. All right. Okay, Thetford. Um, I'll just build things for you as well. I'm going to just take my time, get the economy flowing. And that should increase all of my um, levies and general prestige. Actually, you're 100%. Can I revoke your title yet? 88%. That's more like it. Give me that. That's right. Belong Count Cambridgeshire belongs to me. All right, good. 
Okay, garrison, levies, control the garrison. Alright, now but now I've got plus 20 tyranny, which will disappear very slowly. But still, it's there. Uh, can I have one person who's half good at being a... Ugh. Oh, steward. Oh, okay. wait, wait, where's that new girl? I just bought a girl. Where is she? There she is. Get her in. <laughs> I just bought a girl. Get her in. Pro tip, if you ordain her, you don't have to pay to recruit her. Whoa, hacks. That's like some MLG stuff there. Thank you, Matt. Have you been able to get insane pop-ups for Malks? All right, you guys have your conversation. I'm just experiencing. <laughs> I'm just experiencing the world. I think it's so good. I will promote this to anyone I know till my dying day. I love it. All right, uh, what will happen? She has learned so much. It's going to cost me stress, but she becomes a sister. And she gets plus two learning. Hooray! She is now my heir. So that's how your heirs are chosen. It has to be a female, and they can't be a vampire, I presume. But there she is. Sweet. Now she's converted for me. Second in line for Astorius. So that's down, down in Spain. I'm going to stay away from that just for now. Just going to stay away from that. Alright, Mercia. Are you warring of anyone yet? No. Maybe I can do something to help. Are you any good? Oh, he's weak as hell. Alright, I'm going to kill him. Can I just straight up murder him? 8% no. Can I find Lair? 23% of finding his Lair. Do it. If I weaken Mercia, and by the time this has happened, it takes about four years, I should be re pretty much ready. Yep. Yeah, to attack. King's Lynn. Forgot about you. Look at the, look at the artwork as well. This is all un unique artwork that castle looks amazing for this Lord of the Rings stuff, this Dark Souls stuff in there. Uh, Baron Guichard of Montreuil-sur-Mer has accused my sister, Inquisitrix Laeta, of copulating with her lover, Aubrey. You can't, you, you can't copulate. You're a sister. God will judge these sinners. All right. Well, yeah, she's a fornicator. Uh, what do I do with her? Oh, she's not even in my jail. Bless. <laughs> Give moderate stat and health increase for a time. Oh, so good. Uh, we have made some bright blue text Malkavian Madness tool tips. Only a few places so far. More in the future. The beast talks to vampires more. Oh, okay. The beast. Is the beast the the vampire god? What's the beast? Your silver tongue is shining. Oh, apparently I charmed the vampire. That's all right. <laughs> What's this about? It's, uh, prowess plus 10. Prowess plus 10. Prowess plus 3. Bruya. Aspiring blade master, obviously. Prowess plus six. 63 prowess. Damn. <laughs> Are they at war? Hey, they're at war. And they're at war with these guys. Guess what? I'm jumping in. Uh, I am going to... Actually, before I jump in, I'm going to spend some money on manganels. That's right. I'm going to top that up. Five, five. Yep, that'll do. Wait for that to go. Oh, low county control in Cambridge. Yeah, fix that. Only two years. All right, so I'm going to let him whittle down his forces against this much stronger opponent, but I'm going to try and get the capital, keep hold of it, and hopefully not have to fight the dude. Too bad there are so many bad monks because Lunatic is funny. So, Malkavian, is that a religion? Or is it a culture? What is that? Oh, we can't look for that, can we? Okay. Beefs of the Black Cross Courts of Love. Oh my god. Oh, what happened to the Shadow Inquisition? It went. It's the Shadow Requ Key Conquista is down there. It's got really small. It's a trait. A big dynasty, many houses. Oh, okay. Is that like the Tremiers or whatever it was? I think uh, I did see. Oh, Tremier? Yeah. The first among equals. <laughs> Where are all the ghouls, by the way? I haven't seen any. I've seen... Oh, well, okay. oh yeah, there's nudity and stuff. <laughs> oh, what's going on? In a few days, my damned great-granddaughter. Uh-oh, traveling through Norfolk. If you orchestrate the ambush and capture, I will reward you generously. 95 gold. 
Or I could pretend to accept but warn her and cr uh, basically I could create some trouble inside the house. So that might be a good idea. Yeah, I'm going to take your money, but uh, tell her about it. See what happens. And I get a favor. Lovely jubilee. I get a favor with a vampire. This guy's enemy lives. Uh-oh. Did you really think you'd get away with your little scheme? I have eyes everywhere. Yeah, well, I get it. I swear in my life you will rue the day you decide to cross me. Well, very well. Okay, are you guys down yet? Oh, he's only down 107. Oh, he died. The other ruler died and some other ruler came in. Or he was deposed? Either way, I'm declaring war now. Give me all of Mercia. All right, let's get everybody out. I'm going to... Yep. And call in... Oh, I also have a Munich house member. That's good. All right, you guys are up there. Are there any cool people I have yet to hire? Nope. But I do have a lot of mangonels. All right. Time for trouble and make it double. Yes, indeed, mate. All right, go. All right. Hursting stone? Okay. Excellent. Geisenhausen. All right, all of you, come on. Let's go. All right, so those guys are also at war with them, but they're not our enemies, but we will probably have to fight them for that capital at some point. Here we go. All right, one down, 20%. Let's jump over here. Oh, no. Yeah, let's jump over here and see exactly what's happening with this capital building. Uh, yeah, they're there, but they are not. They're not going for it. Well, I'm going to go for it. And uh, hopefully smash, snatch it before anything happens. Am I going to take this entire duchy without having to have a fight? If I take this capital, I might actually get away with it. 72. All right. Um, okay, we're going over a moat there. Get over there quickly. All right. Ooh. Oh, crap. I'm going to have to fight them in the marsh. Oh, they ran away before taking the thing, so this is technically a defensive battle. Did they invent Gagan Press? Yes, they did. <laughs> I'm not going to catch him, am I? Because it was... Oh, bollocks. Oh, well, let's get it. On the hunt. Uh, you finally tracked down the fiend. Protector Robin Hood. Uh, right, there can be no mistakes as the poor people or uh, surroundings have clearly lost the love of God. They are paranoid, soulless husks, afraid of coming out at night even if the church lies barren. You and your small entourage are clearly the only hope of this place. As you set up your camp, it is time to ponder your next move. The Lord has certainly guided you to this lair of evil, but how to destroy it is left to your appreciation. Okay, so this is basically um, stat checks. Um, diplomacy, martial, stewardship, intrigue, learning, and prowess. There's a prowess challenge, so you could mold a vampire yourself if you wanted. All right. Uh, fear the light of God. Right, okay, well, I'm a steward, 24. So 53% chance... Critical success and we'll capture him, I guess. 33% is a draw, 12% make no mistakes. Okay, let's do that. Let us destroy its assets and isolate the fiend first. Yes, that's so good. A mercenary life. This wicked creature has more pull in the region than you first thought. You have been stoic, though, and you're now pretty sure that most of his assets have been destroyed by your actions. But the vampire won't go down easily, it seems. A powerful band of mercenaries is now marching on your position, apparently employed by your foe to eliminate you. You have a choice. Uh, pay them off or not. Pay them off is 110 gold I can afford, but I gain piety and prestige for paying them off. Interesting. If you have the true faith lifestyle, I do, uh, you'll get some faith lifestyle XP depending on the age of your vampire killed. Oh, okay, so I get renown. All right. What's happening? Is he dead? Oh, it was a bit anticlimactic if it was. Yeah, I must have killed him. I'm guessing he's he's gone. Yeah, there he is. He's gone. Protector Robin Leland, the Outlaw of Mercia. Slain in battle. Well, he died fighting. 
Must have been quite a fight with his prestige, but sorry, prowess being so high. I'm off for the nerd catching bit. See you, Bantin Christ. Take care. I'll be here for a while, no doubt. All right, 54%. If I wipe them out, which I should do, better commander, more. Yep. Yeah. Get him. Get him. Oh, yeah, boy. Thanks for the help. Thanks for the assist. Let's go back and get that because somebody's taken. Oh, that is us. Okay. 68%. Right, well, let's get somewhere else. Thank you very much, my Spanish brethren. Oh, they ran away. I hate it when they do that. Are you going to take that one instead? Okay, just stay next to each other. Oh, what's going on? Ask the Holy Father for funds. Yes. Give me more funds. I'm going to request additional and a new prospect is here. The Pope wasn't fooled by creative accounting. Oh, that's ridiculous. That's some XCOM 2 stuff. The percentage lies. All right. Embrace God. This will be your home. Are you any good? Whoa. Wait a second. So this could be... Wait, 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 wait. So if I convert him, I get this... This vampire. A holy vampire? Whoa, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Ugly, scaly... Vampire... Nosferatu... Oh... Potence. What's this? Obfuscate. Alright, I'm just going to do it to see what all happens here. Yeah, welcome. What about the rest of you? The rest of you are alright. I want to see what happens to you, dude. You have gained a favor hook. Oh, he's not come with us? Oh, that's a shame. He hasn't come with us. No. Oh, well. I thought super good to be true. I could have a vampire. A holy vampire. Oh, look. Look at this. It's gone down to the battle. It's eight versus two. This is the knight's battle. All the levies died instantly. Hooray! Mercia. Enforced demands. Yeah, boy. All right. We now have Mercia. And as a result, I have... I have things to get rid of. So now, Sisters of St. John. We own... Mercia and East Anglia, so that's good. Alright, first things first. I wonder if I should move the capital. I mean, in the normal game, I'd move it out of Norwich as soon as possible, but... Can you still... Uh... Oh, yeah, they have to be converted, so I should probably palm these off. My daughter and heir. Oh, yeah, I'm going to give you a few things. Uh... I'm going to give you Staffordshire, Shropshire... I want Leicester. I noticed that Nottinghamshire is not included. Huh. All right, you can have an Herefordshire. Yeah, you can have all that. I think I can make a duchy now. Oh, no. 250 gold. So, two months. And I need an alliance with her. I can lawfully imprison this one. Why? Fornication! God damn. Literally god damn. Uh, just release, I guess? Take the vows? Sure. I thought you already did. Oh well. Alright, powerful vassals expect council position. 18 diplomacy. And you are red, so yes. Um, okay. And who's the other one? Oh, you're terrible. But you are 19 learning? Okay. Alright. Oh, I don't have a physician. Do I have a decent one here? 18, 19. The bridge builder? Oh, yeah. Yeah, court physician. Good stuff. All right, Mercia, go. Hooray, now we have Duchy of Mercia. My glory is widely known. And some vampire peeps aren't happy. All right. Okay, phase one, done. Phase two. Okay, these two are still at each other's throats. I don't know if I should use this guy or not. Duke John de York, the upstart baron. That's a great name. 
Okay, since I've I've already investigated him, can I scheme better? No. Penance. I can condemn the servant of hell. Hmm. Uh, I should warn you, the CK3 AI doesn't convert disabled duchy buildings. Any buildings, actually, but we managed to work around the basic ones. And there's nothing we can do about it yet. So if you want your vassals to make the most of their domains, you will need to build for them. Oh, okay. All right. Thanks for the warning. That's not a huge problem. Sorry, it's not the dog just... Yelped. All right. Uh, right. Build, build, build. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've got a yellow nine. Do, can you still, like, uh, improve the amount of slots each building has? It's not something I've ever done in the original game, but I'm aware that's a possibility. Also, who are you? Leinster? Wow. You're a vampire? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to grab that in a bit. All right, let's keep going. God, I love this game. This mod and this game. All right. No one else. Cool. What else can we do? Right. Uh, convert to local culture. Oh, yeah. I've not adopted English culture yet. Uh, yeah, I'll be going to do that. It's going to help things in the long term. I'll get longbows eventually. Watch your levies. Keep them high to dissuade vampires from declaring war on you. So high levies means less likely to declare war, of course. Boost them with men at arms if you need to. All right. That sounds good. Oh, I can get eight now. So now that I've sw swapped cultures, I can get more men at arms. So as soon as I get a bit of money together, I'll get the usual bowman first. I'll try and max it out as quick as I can. It does seem quite low. 2,000 when this guy's got... Oh, he's only got 919. He's getting battered. Oh my god. Do I just go straight for it now? Oh, I can't quite do a Holy War for Kingdom. Paragon of Virtue. Oh. Well, I could probably take Essex. And then we'll have London. I'm going to do it. Off we go. Uh, call house members. Okay. Last chance. Anybody else here worth a damn and hiring? There we go. Oh, no. Force. Player heir. Do I want my heir to be in there? Oh, my God. She's got 17 prowess and she's like a 25-year-old accountant. <laughs> Pride is a sin. Stay the course. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go for it. This week, and that's probably most of his tax bases from here. All right, I'll take the nearest one, just to wait for backup to arrive. Uh, my mortal body? Oh, no. Do more than is necessary. Do no more than is necessary. Excellent work, Ankorita. New friends? Yes, friends are arriving. Oh, no, they were just... They just... Friends just sailed right past. I actually prefer taking Kent as it has a holy site. It does have a holy site. It has. Of Canterbury Cathedral. This county's holding this holding. This count holder of this hold holding. 0.3 piety. Monthly renown 5%. Yeah, that's got to be next then, right? That's got to be next. Okay. Religious uprising. All right. How many and where are you? I can't. Did I click the wrong thing? I 
lost a d uh. Well, I'm not crying about it. <laughs> oh boy. Oh well. Uh, let's just keep going, yeah? Are you friendly? You are friendly. Whee! 1,500 people. Yeah, we got this. All right. Well, I'll just go back and claim it in a minute. I don't think there's any truces. And then I'll slaughter them all. <laughs> How dare you make me click the wrong thing? <laughs> this, this death will last a lifetime. 40%. My old self. Yes. Well, yeah, obviously. Oh, sick. Basically, I signed the wrong letter. I was ill. I apologize. It won't happen again. We've put steps to make sure that won't happen again. Uh, yeah. All right, I'll let you sack London. 53%, 65% imprisonment. Oh yes, we've imprisoned somebody. Uh, rip her apart, zero. She will destroy 65 prowess. Uh-oh, Inquisitor prowess challenge. Edward, oh God. She's a bit strong, this one. 41%, I catch it. Yeah, why not? Doesn't seem to be much of a downside. Uh-oh. Oh, there's another guy. Uh, Edward. 71%. Alright, yeah. Prowess challenge. Oh, another one. Uh, okay. 78. Alright, got three vampire checks coming. Lost. One. One. Excellent. Okay, so we lost the one we should have got, but then we got the one we should have lost. So they're in prison now. Oh, there's lots of people in prison. Duncan the Black. Oh, that's a great name. Right, what do we do with the vampires? Do we just kill them? Is there any... Or we can send them back out, right? Oh, but I... Oh, I get Fiend Lover. Inexplicably betrayed the cause by releasing a servant from hell from captivity. Oh, wow. Also, you seem to be in quite a... Oh, so that's a dungeon? <laughs> Did I just... I just gotta kill him. No. Absolute... Oh, burn at stake. Oh, 25 piety if we burn them at the stake. Duncan the Scot. What's the question mark about? Innocent? The majority of humans are innocent. They are ignorant of the world of darkness. They know nothing. Yeah, they know nothing. Check your... Check the box. There is no Fiend Lover modifier. Oh, wasn't there? Oh, I didn't see that. I can't really... I don't have a vampire now. Oh, no. This one's a vampire. I'm going to release it. Oh. Oh. Fane Mercy and release the fiend so that it leads us to his associates. Heir and leech spouse. That's handy. Very well. So, has that automatically happened? Hmm. Who's this guy? He's got zero. Oh. Seeker of knowledge. 68%. Come on, guys. Let's finish this. Plenty of little keeps around here. Can we split you up? Yeah. It looks like nobody's coming. If you run Find Lair and Mythos now, it will be instant. Really? Oh, my God. This, this is so good. Uh, Mithras. 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 There we go. Oh, yeah, there's no time. Oh, it says four years. Wow. That seems OP. Wow. You finally tracked down the fiend to its lair, if you know mistakes. Okay, right, same thing again. I have a bad feeling about this. I will kill you myself. Uh, particular demon in my books. Critical success, 39%. Okay, fear of the light. There we go, so... Intrigue. Yep, stewardship. 51% chance of killing this one. Your, such, your strike was methodical. You targeted every guild, militia, or cultist group the fiend has a claws in. You used two powerful weapons. The lore of gold for the greedy and the fear of the church for the corrupt. And so it came to this. Your campaign has isolated the vampire, estranged his allies, and dispersed his thralls. 
You now watch the last haven of the fiend burning before your eyes. The screams of the creature inside, like music to your ears. You're fired. <laughs> there really should be contextual shine-ons. Is there? I mean, if I stab him in the back, does it say, you get the point? <laughs> Something like that. Oh, I could write those for you. <laughs> All right, you're fired. A curse undone. The twisted says of fate have not always been to my advantage. God knows that I was cursed the day I met Lord Mithras. Today, however, the curse has been lifted. Fate has smiled upon me and brought the abhorrent leech to his grave. Lech. Not a day too soon. So he was my rival. So, yay. He's dead. That's like a vampire god dead. Wow. All right, let's just get the rest of his kingdom. Or duchy. And then we'll go kingdom. Not quite sure what to do with uh, my victory, though. Just like Hannibal. All right. So you inherited Lady Eleanor of Avalon. A new vampire, aren't you? Hey, what's that? What's that? Blood hunger. Ravenous, right. Blood hunger is... Control over the beast? Is that right? All right. Sisters of St. John. London. Right, what was it he said? Um, I have to manually convert these things. Because... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're gonna... London's the capital now. And do I have to create the duchy? I do. Usurp. Oh, that's 500. 250. Oh, that's quite cheap. Oh, no. They got disbanded it, so... I have to create it now. Hooray! We use blood for a bunch of vampire-related stuff. Okay. Spells and stuff, I assume. Okay, right. Oh, because you're a different ruler, we don't have... Right, oh yeah, let's go back and just grab it. We gotta grab all the things. Oh, my claims? Use prestige or... I think piety is a little bit. Actually, you got plenty of prestige. Yep, go for it. Uh, I shouldn't have a problem killing them. They don't have an ally or anything. That's all. That's their entire army. Yeah, much earlier start today than normal. Uh, if anyone doesn't know, there's quite a few new people. I live, I, despite sounding like I'm from the Game of Thrones cast, I uh, live in America. So, um, times get referenced wrong. Oh, right. Yeah, there's even a, a whole renown legacy tree. Oh, my God. Meritocracy. Wait. That's only a thousand, but these are five thousand. Can recruit Zmlin. And I've got how much of these cost? It doesn't say. Wait, why is it offset? Oh, because it's only three. Wait, how do we use this then? What's the figure? Whatever it is, I'm gonna save it. I wanna find out what gods and monsters. Low county control, yes. And lots of disabled buildings. Differently abled buildings. Alright. Well, I think we'll do the same thing. We will... Just drop some people there and go a-killing. Ah, <laughs> changed your mind, did you? Oh, wow, look. Okay, so they had a few hundred and we had a few thousand, but they have high prowess eight champions. Oh, I don't have a single knight with me? Holy fuck. So eight champions just wiped out thousands of people. <laughs> wow. All right. Uh, yeah, give me Mercia back. Sorry about that. That was a mistake. Administ administration error. Oh, true faith. Oh, I can... Oh, yeah. 
So that tree's already full, so I don't have to click that when I'm starting. Because I'll just get that as soon as the game starts anyway, so I should just go straight into a normal lifestyle tree. Okay. I'm confirming it myself. Oh, there's an election for... Mercia. Oh, cancel that law, please. 4,300 prestige. Oh, shit. Wow. That is unfortunate. Mercy is going to be a bit of a problem then until we get an absurd amount of prestige. Because, um... Oh, no, it's just my sisters, though. That's okay. Uh, which one? Yeah, that, that one's my heir, so I'll vote for that. Okay, ooh. Vampires come in huge dynasties with multiple kings and emperors, so they get a tons of renown from the start, and legacies usable by them have to be pricier. Every new legacy track we make is only for non-vampires, and we have standard price. We obviously need more of them, so the more dynasties at the top for certain vampire clans only, you can spend your renown. Oh, so just vampires will have access to that tree, but it's just, it's there now. Okay. Great. All right. Um, pilgrimage. Vatican. Let's go to Jerusalem. Just get big. There we go. Oops. Yeah, that's a problem. That won't ever go away, that will it? Oh, well. If I right click it, it should just ignore it. Okay. Oh, comes back. Oh, that came back. Okay. So I need to get rid of four places. Let's just get rid of temples and stuff because... Because... Thetford... To... Castle, 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 castle. Northampton Castle. The Unbroken of the Knights of Acre. Oh my god, that's the best name. There you go. I mean, those perks you could pick aren't for you. Yeah. Oh, R for you. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, so... Right, hang on. What's my, where's my... Um, dynasty? Wait, how do I get into that here? Oh, legacies. So those ones we can pick. But that one, this is cheaper. It's a small health boost. But if I save it, I get access to... These are all the same. There's no changes. Okay. Well, meritocracy, weapons training... One prowess seems a bit cheap. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for that and get the uh, two knights because they're the important things. All uh, right, too many duchies held. All right, let's get rid of East Anglia is very well developed. Mercia. Yeah, let's get rid of Mercia and give it to Spymaster and Champion Ezio. <laughs> the unassuming. Oh yeah, let's give it to Ezio. I don't want to give you all those. Actually, let's give it to somebody who already has something here. Uh, who has... Shropshire? Why can't I give her a title? Oh, because she's the director. Uh, oh, and also she's over here? Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Grant title, Duchy of Mercia. Oh no, I don't need to give you one. Good, go. All right, Mercia is in capable hands. Ransom prisoners, prisoner and vassal. Oh, get rid of him, he seems pretty cool. 30 gold, yeah. Baron, dishonorable villain. Hmm. Those effects you see are for existing hunters. The main effect of the perk is making new ones come with cool traits. I should have communicated that more explicitly. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's yeah. I wasn't sure what that meant. <laughs> I didn't read it. But I am known for not paying attention. So don't take that as if everyone else will react this way. Okay, let's look at that again. Learn to elevate those most talented and diligent. Your prospects will be more physically able. Men's sana in corporo sano. I have no idea what that is. All right. So every new person is the merit meritocracy. Every new person will have more prowess. Every new person will have more learning. Every new person will have popular opinion and monthly piety. Right, I get it. So that I really probably should focus on that then because we're going to go through a lot of people. 
All right. Uh, people in prison. Baron Sunfried of Peterborough. Okay, he's gone. You. Uh, you are innocent. You don't know of the wars. Let us demand a conversion. I will open your eyes, Duncan the Black. I you, Your stats aren't very good, but your name is Duncan the Black, so I'm hiring you. What about you, Alan? <laughs> Duncan the Black, God Scribe, and Alan. Uh, I don't. If I convert, I have to pay for you or something. I just, just, just get out. Who's this? God stand the tired warrior. Eighty three. Oh, he's a vampire. Fucking hell. Panic then. <laughs> one thousand one hundred and forty five years old. Sure, I can't convert you. No. Who is your liege? He doesn't have one. Yeah, just kill him then. Burn at stake. And another vampire. No liege. Kill her. Them. That. Burn at stake. Alright, Duncan. Duncan the Black, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, Duncan. Alright, Temple. Walsingham. Low Noble. Don't die. I'm back. What did I miss? Any non-none events? Yeah, we. Yeah, I'm doing pretty well. That's not exactly what it does. For example, how your prospects will be strong. Now your prospects will be strong and athletic. Oh, is that guaranteed or is that... Like, now you have a chance for that to happen. The last perk gives you a higher chance of true faith, which is one I can give to people, right? Intercession. A chance of gaining the true faith trait, yeah, okay. Alright, I'm in debt. Help me. Uh, God would wish me to, of course. It's guaranteed. Right, okay. So just... <laughs> yeah. Pilgrimage, loss of companions. Some of the locals will make fierce guards. Yeah, no. Not paying for it. Since we're so skint. I have walked the holy path. The only path that I have ever known. For those of you that are new here, I swear I'm sane. <laughs> I swear it. It's good to be home. All right, what's going on? Holy Father, grant thee thou endowment. No, not that. Additional funds, 46%. Why? Oh, is the Holy Father, like, shrewd now? Oh, inflate your expenses. There you go. Set, set, I clicked the wrong one. The sking, singing will scare away vampires. Yes, they are known to hate high-pitched shriek, shrieking. <laughs> All right, invite prospects. Who are you? And now she's strong and athletic. Confirmed. Confirmed indeed. Confirmed. All traits. Jean de Canville. Hello, Jean. All right, let us... Oh, I don't need to make her the heir, do I? Probably wait a bit. Wait, so I can invite the recruits to court. Yeah, get her in court. Oh my god, I'm loving this game so much. Disabled buildings. Differently abled. Alright, uh... Do I have money yet? Yes, I do. Uh, so I have to rebuild everything, basically. If I take it from a vampire. Well, that is unfortunate. Incredible work, Tutor. Oh! I had a truce. Now I don't have a truce. I can do a holy war for the entire kingdom. I think now. Oh, very close. Very close. First in life and all that. Oh, yeah, that's mine. Uh, okay, powerful people. God's mercy. Peter Thetford and Br Baron Stephen of Walsingham. Yeah, you guys all suck, so no. Low county control. We can figure that out. Whoa, okay. It's almost like there was a war here. Okay. Oh, I can't see the lovely lady's face because of my event list. I'm sorry. I wasn't aware of that. Yeah, there we go. That should do. Oh, that's covering a lot as well. I'll tell you what, I'll just get rid of that. Oh, no, I'll tell you what I can do. No, let's get rid of it. Okay. All right. Uh, oh, okay, right. So, yeah, they're doing it again. I'm going to make sure... Oh, no, it's a different thing. This is just a peasant uprising. Yeah, peasant revolt. Surprise, a peasant can write. Get him. 
Presumably, they are led by idiots. <laughs> yeah. That peasant leaders are very good to turn. Army gold maintenance minus 50%. 50. Very good things to have in your army as a general if they're half good. But, uh... Five prowess. Yeah, convert and recruit. Yeah, just get everything. Just in case I need a secondary army somewhere. Ella de la Pole. All right, come on. Oh, you want freedom? You shall have it in death. Look at these vampires. 4,000. Are they peasants? Oh, they're all levies. All right, well, we shouldn't have a problem then. Those of you that are making this mod, it was fun before and it looks like it's getting even more fun. I hope you keep working on the mod as Paradox patches and add stuff. I really love the lore of the Vampire Universe and I've enjoyed faffing around with it. Faffing around with it, Don. Treat him with more respect. It's I want to learn about the, the world, but it's just... I actually spent like an hour looking at where I should start and holy shit, there's a lot to catch. There's a lot to catch up on. It's not quite Warhammer level, but it's pretty big. All right, I should win that because they don't have a single knight. Yep, gotcha. What about you? Oh my god, it's a dwarf vampire. Some sick vampire turned him. Just for laughs. Uh, execute. Burn the dwarf. Don't clip that. All right, yeah, different start time today. Um, so thank you for joining so far. I appreciate that. Thank you to the new people. If you are unaware, my name is The Reckonist. I stream games, mainly strategy-based games, simulation games, occasionally some nonsense. And I do it a few times a week. So click follow if you haven't already. And if you think this is worth a pint once a month, why not visit Patreon and become a Patreon? Or just fire your Twitch Prime subs if you haven't already. Why not? Show support. Send love. The Wash? Is that really called The Wash? Even though it's called the what? I knew Dargo Bank was there, but wow. Okay. Right, am I now a Paragon of Virtue? I certainly am, and they are in lots of wars. It's the perfect time. Holy War for Kingdom. The culmination of my life. Raise all. Bring all house members. If they are not up to anything. Inquisitrix Tutor of München. All right. Where's the capital? Seriously, where where did you put your capital? Oh, great. Uh They haven't the the capital's still here? All right. Oh, look at that sim. Look at that. That's so good. I don't even know if that... Oculi Day. God's Eye? Oculi Day Eye. Is that right? Yeah. Uh, right, well, I don't know where your capital is, so I'm just going to take everything. Hope you don't mind. Kent included. We've got a full squad of mangonels. Oh, god damn it. Right, if these are all just levies, I should be alright. Yep, they're all levies. I'm gonna leave you there to go ahead and sack Kent Imprisonment. You are trying to imprison a spawn of the devil, William, but the leeches are unlikely to let servants of God catch them. What would you do? Rip them apart. Edward. Who's Edward? Oh, my marshal? Okay. New prisoner. Alright, who's your liege? Oh, your liege is this dude. So I should... Release him? And then track down? If it works? 
I don't know, but now find lair should be instant. Wait. Didn't work. Damn it. Gotcha. Done. Enforce demands. Done. Okay, let's uh, go back down here. Take that. Oh, wow. Another one. So the best thing to do with these vampires is just kill them unless you want to get to their lord where you set them off. But you can't do anything else with them. 74, 63, 74. Gotcha. Now what will I do with you? Oh, wait. Oh, she was the vampire. No, just kill this one. Burn at the stake. Okay. Beer merchant. Yes, we should sell beer. 88% chance. Own distribution network for beer. Beer anyone? <laughs> at the cost of prestige. But I got money. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Killed some people there by mistake. Is this multiplayer accessible? Has anyone tried the multiplayer? Like on a campaign? Oh my god. Angisel, oh, oh, he's a forty-eight. What the hell is that? Via Adventsaris, the path of the devil is not to be confused with so-called Via Diabolis. These sinners work to keep themselves from being manipulated. The ultimate control freaks. They will go to extreme lengths to protect their free will, and usually the free will of others. Many consider them more pleasant of the sinners. Oh, very well. Well, I might lose this check. Put the fifty-fifty. 50-50 chance on a martial challenge. And we lost the fight. It is merely a setback. It was merely a setback. Yes, though, you need to make absolutely certain you have the same checksum. And for some reason, that means you have to get the mod from the same source. So, yeah. So you can't have a Paradox Plaza up one and you can't have a Steam one together, right? Okay. Just has to match. Okay. Uh, imprisonment again? All these vampires get into. Mm, hello. Oh, yeah. Whoever's done the graphics for this, like the sort of the skins and stuff, and like, you know, all Nosferatu and all the animalistic stuff, it's fantastic. Like, fantastic. 66% chance. Do it. Gotcha. Kill. Fifty-two percent. Oh, I don't have a general. The Dragon Slayer. Oh wow. Right. How can I make him live forever? <laughs> Doesn't have the truth. Oh, he does have true faith. Is there a way to make this man immortal or semi-immortal like me? Oh yeah, you guys should be like way over this. Go get Stonehenge. Hey, yeah, what's Stonehenge doing this game? Same. True faith conversion cost minus 20. Monthly learning lifestyle expert. 15%. That's huge. You can heal him for starters. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Lay on hands, was it? Crap, crap, crap. Where is he? There he is. Uh, lay on hands. Now he's cured of all wounds. What else can I do with him? I could seduce some romance. Bless. Give this player a moderate stat and health increase for a time. Spiritual guidance. Oh, so that's negate negative. Check your buildings again. Oh, okay. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, damn it. I'm not doing anything. Cost Just spending money. Just costing me money. Oh, Welsh. Get there before the Welsh get it. Drop that. I don't know if... Is this the Welsh people that have done it? 
I don't know. Oh, okay, yeah, I got him. I was about to go and help you. You don't need my help. I'm learning so much. I think if all these pop off. Oh, 800 and... Oh, goddamn. Ha-ha! We win that one. I'm gonna go up to Buckingham. Ninety-one percent. Yep, I'm gonna do it. One hundred percent. I now proclaim myself God Scribe of England. Oh my God! Look at this Irish place in the middle. Can't have that. <laughs> All right. I could just do that, but I get it. Okay, right. Well, 32 holdings. Crap. <laughs> Holy Father. I need additional funds, Holy Father. Can't you see we're having a real tough time here? Oh, Cornwall. <laughs> Cornwall keeps its independence to the vampires. <laughs> oh, yeah, great. Okay. Well, now I've got to divvy all this out. Titles can be usurped. Yes, they can. Come on, Holy Father. Give me money. Thank you. Titles can be created. Kingdom of England, 500. Ah, best wait for that. Oh, too many duchies. Wessex, East Anglia. Wessex can go to someone. My granddaughter, and I will give them the entirety of Wessex. There you go. Happy birthday. Okay, you sup. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for England before I do anything else. Ping. Two, one. Oh my god, hold on, August. It's taking far too long. Ping. There we go. Kingdom of England. Wait, 500? I do have 500. Told you. Mario, how's it going, mate? Welcome as we create the King of England. Dumb. Support from the Sisters of St. John. We've done it. We've done it. You are an independent ruler, a thousand piety. Just. Kingdom of England must be held by me. Mithras and Marcus are dead. The heart of God stands at the ready. Well, I don't understand what happens here. The Sisters will send one of their best to help you. You will also reinvigorate the Inquisition and be one step closer towards unifying it. Okay. The caring hand of God. The Sisters of St. John are perhaps the less visible order, the least visible the less visible order of the Inquisition, but they perform the hardest duty. Plagued by visions that drive many to madness, the sisters have endured a burden that will cause few ever hope to survive. So what? A blessed woman. Sisters, all of us get godly care? All Inquisitors. Monthly piety, less stress, more opinion. So to unify the Shadow Inquisition, we have to do all these things. The supports. Accra, Occhio Dai. Oh, we were just there, weren't we? Kingdom of France. Yep. Yeah. So France is next. Rome, Ro Rome. Sorry, Romania. Bavaria. Yep. Yeah. So that's basically it. Thessalonica and Cyprus. So yeah. So the game is basically for the sisters is to yeah Bavaria, France, and down there. She looks like an heir to me. I didn't even see who it was. I don't know who it was. I just got... I clicked off it. <laughs> How do I find that? Yeah, you're a little bit better than this. I don't know who it is or how to find them or what. She won't be ordained if you remember someone after her. Yeah, I don't know who it was. I've lost it. Sort your own by sum of all skills. It's probably going to be the best one then, yeah? Okay. Um, 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 um. Who's bad? Who's bad? Sum of all skills. That's not her, is it? Is it this 18-year-old one? It looks like it's this one. But she doesn't have, um, 
She doesn't have the strength or... Oh, she's genius, though. Genius. Ordination. You are now my heir. 95% chance. Good. Also, guess what? You are now Chancellor. If I can, I can. Deal with it. Should probably give you some land or something as well. Um... Yeah. Sorry, I haven't uh, got my dashboard open though. Do, do, do. Okay. Right, done. Uh, I can't give her titles because she is the heir. Uh, forgot about that. Uh, these people don't have... You can have a title. Let's give you something. You can have... No, I'm going to keep Essex and East Anglia. So you can have any of these. Uh, mm, I'd quite like to have York. So... Wait, is it North Riding? West Riding is Leeds. Yeah. Well done. Okay. Has you ever noticed that there are more options for ordination outcomes than plus two learning? I have not. So that's... Wait. I can't ordinate. No. Okay. So there's more options. Okay. I can lawfully imprison my daughter and heir. She's been here a week. Oh, right, it's a different one. <laughs> She's currently still the heir. At the finish, not the start. God is with us. Militant inquisitors with the hunt. Oh, crusades. Crusades can happen now. All right. I need to get rid of these. Uh, I don't have enough money to make the duchies, though. Hi, would you like some titles, chaplain? Actually, you're only seven. Ah, oh, having that. 22. There we go. Inquisitor Giordano Nicola di Artenza. Congratulations. You also get these wonderful titles. Of Cheshire, Westmoreland, Lancashire and Derby. That's Lancashire for you. I need to get rid of 10 more. Oh my god. Alright. Grant to... Uh, granddaughter. Durham, Cumberland, Northumberland. Westmoreland? Oh, that's in Lancashire? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> As I was going to Derby upon a market day. Oh, are you about to read is it a Philip Larkin poem? <laughs> What's going on here? Are you going to finish this, Antichrist? Are you going to try and co convince us that you're intelligent by quoting one line of a poem? <laughs> What's going on? All right. Uh, Joan. Joan de Canville. I'm going to give you three. Yeah, there you go. And there's four more to go. I really wish there was a one-click button for this where you could automatically do it, should you wish. I'm going to keep Kent. So Chertsey can go somewhere. Oh, yes. Sorry, Sussex. I'm keeping Kent. Shropshire. Hertfordshire. And then that's 10 out of 10. So I keep Stonehenge. Canterbury. Cathedral. Oh, no, I don't get Stonehenge. Wiltshire's already taken. Okay. Pro tip number three, and I'm off to sleep. Oh, whereabouts in the world are you, Matt? You want to max your regrown, renowned gains? It's best to give titles to your dynasty members as they will build buildings to generate renown for the whole dynasty. Thank you very much. Oh, my God, Matt. Could you put the right those down? <laughs> I should probably write those down. Thank you very much for dropping in. I appreciate it. Sounds like you're in the land of Oz. I have to transfer Hartford, yeah. Okay. Disabled buildings. Yeah, let's just leave this. Honestly, if I could, I'd make sleeping around not a crime because it takes up too much of my time dealing with all these hussies. Ooh, there's a bit of a slowdown going on. Oh, Crusade where? Where, 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 where? 
reached my court. Grand husband has decided that it's time for a righteous inquisitor. Oh, my warriors will be ready to fight. Doesn't say where. Uh, where is that? Oh, Bavaria area? B Bavaria? <laughs> Bavaria. All right, sure. That's not a bad place to go. I'll come with you. Okay, just get some money back and put some stability. All right, let's get our capital in order for both religion and faith. Sorry, um, yeah, crap. Yeah, control and faith and stuff. Good. Great stream. I'll be tuning in for future for sure. On the land, I am med schoolier. Oh, med school. <laughs> oh, yeah. Take care, mate. Have a good shift, etc. And asleep, of course. Take care, mate. Thank you very much for dropping in. And uh, all your hard work on this. All right. Let us destroy an assert. Okay, who are you? Self-proclaimed Archbishop. Wow. These names. Assets. Oh, I offer golden salvation. Oh, yeah. Looks like he hired people. Cool. She has learned so much. Oh, I can increase her stats here. Right. So two learning, two stewardship, two diplomacy. Well, she looks like she's going to be the diplo. But I will like the idea of her having a little bit more chance of having an extra domain. So there we go. Right. Can I do other things? Can I do other things to her? <laughs> Intercession. She doesn't have true faith. Not the song. Lord protect thee. Okay. What else can I do? Bless. Giving moderate stat and health increase. Okay, let's check that. 12, 12, 27, 12, 18. What? How long does that last for? Five years. Every five years. Oh my god. That's brilliant. That's the best character I've ever seen. 25 prowess, 17 learning, 12 entry, 23, 32, 17. Oh my god. All right. Oh, more stewardship. Uh, tax. Yeah, so consolidation will be the name of the game. Oh, and also we have absorbed that place that was Irish. Great. Oh yeah, can we vassalize? I know this Welsh and English cultures, but... Vassalizing vampires doesn't work. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. So, I think that's probably, for a bonus stream, that's probably a lot. That is the Princes of Darkness mod. And this is just one aspect of it. I'm playing one side of a great war. All these things. You can be a vampire or you can be a vampire hunter. There are real life historical figures that you can make yourself. Honestly, I can't praise it enough. Just go go ahead, click on the Steam Workshop link. I'll leave it in the video description. And um, consider supporting on Patreon because, let's be honest, this is a cause worthy. If you think this game is good, check out, check out the Patreon and see what you can do. But thank you very much for watching, guys. This is a, a Monday Crusader Kings stream. I usually do what I call a Monarch Monday, but a slight twist. It is Crusader Kings, but uh, not, the, not the save game that I was going to carry on. Well, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I shall tell you what, shall we get a bit more of a head in the Crusader Kings community? Let's do a little bit of a raid. Uh, wow. Um, okay. So I'm quite high up <laughs> on that. Um, right. Gotta be English. Here we go. Izari? Uh, yeah, Izari. Let's go ahead and raid Izari. Yeah. Izari. Wait, Izar? Wait, I just saw it. What a thing. Oh, double A. Izari, Crusader Kings. It looks like it's only them watching their own stream. Let's be nice to them, go over there. Give somebody, you know, a little bit of a cheer. Maybe you'll like what they do. All right, guys, take care. I will see you tomorrow.